everyone, it's Sadie Rose and for today's video I'm going to be showing you my everyday summer makeup routine and it is finally summer, it's July now which is amazing like oh my god and it's so nice outside. So today I'm going to be showing you kind of, it not, well not a school makeup routine because I'll be a bit boring because I don't really wear too much makeup for school but it's kind of like an everyday summer dewy nice pretty pink makeup look for summer so I thought you guys would enjoy a video like that if you do give it a big thumbs up and let's get started so the first thing I like to use is a moisturizer just to keep it a bit more dewy and to moisturize my skin so I use the clean and clear dual action moisturizer um yeah I just really like this it's like three pounds uh so I'm just gonna apply this and the thing I really like about this is that it's like really light on your face so it's perfect for summer when it's quite hot outside so obviously like it's not very heavy on your skin and I just really really do like this moisturiser and obviously it is very very cheap at £3 I'm pretty sure, 3 to £4 and it's amazing. So now I'm going to be applying some primer so I'm just going to be using my all time fave baby skin and nothing special about this, I use this all the time, it's just a primer and I don't really see much of a difference using this but I feel like it makes me feel like I'm doing my makeup right if I use a primer. Don't know if anyone else feels like that but I thought I would prime my face just because it's quite warm outside today so I thought it would maybe be nice for it to last a bit longer considering I'm using a primer. So then I am going to be taking my Rimmel London BB Cream in the shade Very Light. I might pick up another one of these in the next shade down just because I don't really like to look really light in the summer obviously. So um, this is a bit light but it's my skin tone because I am very very light. And I'm just going to apply this straight into my beauty blender. I never normally do it like this but I think that's probably quite a good method. I don't know to apply it. And I just blend it in with my Real Techniques Beauty Blender because I really, really like this one. It's really bouncy. It absorbs, like, it doesn't absorb too much of your makeup and it's really, really soft and bouncy, as I said. And it applies this BB cream really, really nicely. And I don't like to put on too much BB cream because I'm not too much of a fan of, like, full coverage, especially in summer. Um... I just apply this. So now I'm going to be taking my favourite concealer which is the Collection Lasting Perfection Ultimate Wear Concealer in the shade Fair One. Um, this is my favourite concealer as you guys know and I just put it under my eyes in triangle because apparently that gives more coverage. Not sure but apparently it does and I personally think it does and it brightens up your face a bit more than just like doing like a circle under your eye. Then I apply it around my nose because I've got really dark like pores around my nose. I'm not really too sure what they are. And then on my spots I've got a big old spot here and just kind of dot it around my forehead. And then again I like to blend that in with my beauty blend but sometimes I do blend it in with a different brush but for today I'm feeling like beauty blender probably gives the nicest finish that I want to go for. And also how are you guys liking me uploading on um, Fridays now I'm not sure if you guys like that or not because I'm kind of not getting as many kind of views which I don't really mind but it kind of just I don't know I feel like you guys probably don't like I feel like Friday is not the best upload time for me or for you guys I don't know I'm just testing it out for now but comment below if you would if there's any other like times you would prefer or I could just switch to like uploading whenever like in the week but I feel like I prefer to have a routine. So comment if you still like me uploading on Fridays or if you want me to upload kind of like Sunday 10 a.m., Saturday 10 a.m. or, you know, because I like uploading in the morning, um, but then on Fridays it's kind of easier for me, but I don't know, it depends. But just comment below when you want me to upload my weekly video. And also, <laughs> head over to my vlog channel. I've started uploading more vlogs. So I've uploaded a vlog from shopping and um yeah head over there and check out my vlog channel next i'm going to be using my natural collection pressed powder in the shade neutral and i love this it's i'm not going to be applying too much obviously because it's summer and i want a dewy look 
But I'm just going to be taking my powder brush, which I recently just cleaned. And the bristles are all like nice and soft. And I'm going to ruin it again, but got to be done. I'm literally just going to be putting this on my T-zone because I don't want too much powder and under my eyes I mean I will put a bit on my chin and on my cheeks but not too much because I do like the dewy look in the summer and then on my forehead because I do have quite an oily, fo oily forehead so now we're on to kind of like the face so the product that I've been using for my bronzer is the Naked Urban Decay Flush Palette which you guys know I love um, but I don't normally pick it up and this month I've really been enjoying it so to do my contour I take my freshly washed uh, Real Techniques buffing brush, it's rubbed off but I do use this brush and I basically just dip in to the bronzer shade and by the way my palette's in the shade Naked, not sure if that makes a difference, like pretty sure there's different shades but I'm not too sure. Tap it off and then I basically just suck in my cheeks and just go kind of generally across my cheekbones and blend it out because I don't like a harsh contour at all. I do it on my temples as well just to warm them up because obviously my face is really pale so I like to use a tiny bit of bronzer just to bronze up my face so now I'm going to move on to blush so the blusher that I am going to use is the Makeup Revolution Vivid Bake Blusher in the shade All I Think About You I don't generally tend to use this but I thought today it's quite a summery pink blush and obviously I'm kind of going for quite a pinky dewy. I'm not too sure yet. Um, oh, dropped a brush. But basically, I'm going to be taking this on my freshly washed blush brush, which I'm really sad about because this is my favourite brush. It's the softest thing you will ever feel. I'm just going to put it on the apples of my cheeks. Then again, I'm going to be taking my naked flushed and I'm going to be using my contour brush and taking the highlight shade because this is very kind of pinky toned. I don't normally like this highlight, but at the moment I've been trying it out and I do actually really like it. So I normally tend to put this like on my cheekbones, um, on the tip of my nose and the cupid's bow. So now I'm just gonna do my eyebrows off camera because I haven't changed my eyebrow routine very like often so I'm just going to be taking the same product with the seam the same product which is the um Rimmel Brow this dropping everything the Rimmel Brow this way and um I just fill them in basically and then put this brow gel on top so that is all I'm going to be doing for my brows so I'm not going to film that um but I'll be right back once I've finished my brows so I finished my eyebrows and now I'm going to be using the Revolution Perfect Setting Spray just to set the face makeup because I love this stuff and I basically just spray it all over my face. So now moving on to eyes, I'm going to be using my fave palette which is the Too Faced Sweet Peach and I think I'm going to go for quite a pinky look. So I'm going to take the shade, the shade Georgia and Candied Peach. So I'm just going to take them on my 17 Eyes brush and I'm just going to Mix them, tap it off, and then go in the crease. So next I'm going to be taking the shade Bellini, which is this really, really pretty peachy shimmer, and I'm going to be taking it on this little brush, don't know where it's from, and basically just pack this all over the lid. I absolutely love this shade. It's just so, so pretty. Oh my God. So pretty. So now that I've done the eyeshadow, I'm going to be taking my natural collection eyeshadow in the shade White Opal. And as you guys know, I love this one. I'm just going to be taking it on my itty bitty little techniques brush and I'm going to be putting it in the inner corner and a bit underneath the brow bone just to kind of lift up my brows and make them look a bit better. Then I'm going to take my Maybelline Lash Sensational in Intense Black and I'm just going to apply this in the mirror. And then to finish off the look, I'm going to be taking my Sweet Sheen MUA Lip Balm in the shade 
peach dream because this is very very pretty and I love it and that is the finished look so that's the end of my everyday kind of summer makeup routine if you enjoyed it don't forget to give it a massive thumbs up leave a friendly comment down below and let's try and get this to 100 thumbs up if you're new here and you've never seen my face before don't forget to subscribe up here or down below and i will see you in my next video bye